The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Atlanta, Georgia. Weighing in at 281 pounds, the Beast Gilbert. This one's going to be electric. The WWE Universe on its feet, looking forward to this great match. And his opponent, accompanied by Big E, representing the Hooligans, from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 245 pounds, Jason Jordan. Oh boy, we're in for a treat tonight. Both of these superstars look geared up and ready to go. Wow, we have got a pay-per-view quality match coming up right here on Raw. And there's the bell, and here we go. This is the type of battle that you can show someone who's new to our brand of entertainment and say, this is what WWE's all about. Have you guys seen all the trash talk on social media lately? Let's just say some things were said there that, well, would make a sailor blush. The greatest sports entertainment in the world. But hey, the fans of Tulsa, Oklahoma have waited long enough. Let's let the action speak for itself. here. I don't remember the last time he executed that maneuver. The chest cavity can only withstand so much abuse before it collapses. I hope we don't see that here. A move like that is completely unnecessary, unless you want to degrade your opposition, of course. I agree, Cole. I mean, this is intentional humiliation. <laughs> he's starting to stagger a bit, but he's very aware of who he's in there with and what he has to do to rebound. And it looks to me like neither of these guys are showing signs of pulling away here. I don't disagree. And one thing I'll never do is count this guy out. He's starting to stumble here. This could be the start of an ugly downward spiral if he's not careful. Here's the deal with this guy. You can knock him around all you like, but he's just going to keep getting up and coming back at you. Well, it's hard to argue that, but I'd say this one could go either way. Putting a downward thrust on that elbow drop. Ooh, it landed right on the money, too. Take just look at this man. He's off business. And that's the way he has to be if he wants to win here tonight. certainly showing us something new from his repertoire. That's cool. I like new stuff. Not a lot of spring left in his step right now. Oh my gosh! What a slam! Heads up! Where did this explosion of offense come from? Look at those eyes. Oh yeah, this could be big. Suplex. This guy has strength, that's for sure. He was one step ahead on that one. 
He's not looking good here. He'll need to find a way to turn things around here. Well, this might finally be where one of these guys starts to pull away. You know what pride is on the line? Competitors really seem to kick it up a notch. And I think that's what we're about to see here tonight. His midsection taking a lot of damage. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. Oh, out of nowhere! Looking at it here. Man, he's still down after that move. I almost wonder if his bell got seriously rung there. Take a look at this one more time. I've never seen anything like it. Could this be it? I think so. Looks like he's having trouble staying in the ring. Oh, look at the emotion. Well, that messed him all right. Hey, did you look before firing? What an idiot. Back inside the ring now. On the apron. And now the manager is completely distracted. And with his back to the action like this, anything can happen to the outside, where a lot of damage can be done in under 10 seconds. He's got 10 seconds to get back in, or this is over. Back into the ring now. He's spending more time outside the ring than in it. He's really zeroing in on the chest now. Yeah, he's going to have a pirate's dream soon. A sunken chest. Two. Oh, I'm steady on the feet there. Yeah, that's what we call spaghetti legs. Look at that. Three. Somehow, he's kicking into another gear here tonight. He gets out of trouble there. Jason Jordan hits the mat hard. Tough luck, Jason. Four. Oh, his body has to be broken right now. He's simply reminding him that he's here. Okay, once you get outside the ring, anything can happen. Yeah, and it usually does. Over the years, I've seen more careers come to an abrupt end outside of the ring than I can remember. This area is so dangerous. You don't see that move every day. How will these guys do with absorbing the punishment they're about to receive out here? You can practically feel the wear and tear. Jason Jordan looked impressive tonight.